What's the craziest thing? Is with, it really is a bad idea? No, it's not a bad idea. What's the craziest thing with your own eyes you've seen at the uh, at the at the gathering that you can talk about allegedly that you allegedly saw with your own eyes? Yeah, no, man, I, I allegedly nothing. The gathering is off the fucking chain. I dude, I want to, I, I want to fucking go. <laughs> no, like, what's about in the middle it. of Ohio, right? Bro, listen, I I, I I really advise you to go on, on account of this. I know you're a wise man, mm-hmm. and there's nothing worth more than experiences, memories. For sure. You know what I'm saying? And you will absolutely never forget, not if you live to be a thousand, right. going to the gathering, bro. And, and there is absolutely no fucking danger. Right, and that's the and, biggest misconception. Wait, didn't didn't somebody get booed off stage? It was was it Tila Tequila? Yeah, <laughs> that was so. And then didn't well, who was <laughs> unless the, you're an artist, unless you're an artist, <laughs> and they don't right. like you. Because <laughs> wow, who, what a weird thing! I just said there's no danger, and then you're like, what about Tila Tequila? <laughs> unless you're an artist, Cause, yeah, absolutely, you're right. There has been rappers that they've thrown shit at. Fuck yeah, my heroes, bro. Who? I've, I've seen, I've seen some of my heroes. Go down wow. and leave the stage. You know what I mean? Wow. Like who? Too short. Oh. They almost got old dirty bastard off. Oh. And it was, I believe, the last concert of his life. Wow. Oh, you had ODB at the gathering? Right before he passed away, yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. Man. Were you able to talk with him when he got there? Who was up there? Somebody ran up there with ODB. That sounds and was crazy. like, because they were throwing shit. Yeah. And ODB was starting to get mad, you know. I mean, they throw shit. That's what they do. They're not always trying to hit you. Right. They're just throwing shit. Yeah, Look in the, in the air. Yeah. They throw shit. There's just shit flying everywhere, right, you know, right, right. including at the stage, you know. And uh, some people don't know how to do it. Other people like Yellow Wolf, that motherfucker caught, a, you know, and drank it. <laughs> and, and the place popped. You like know fucking I mean? Stone like, Cold catching a beer on the fucking Exactly. The, the crowd loved it. Like, he's, he's saying, I got no problem with this. Yeah. I'm rocking this. Right, right, right. You know right, what right. I mean? And, and um, that's what you the kind of energy you have to have. Because sometimes guys get up there and they get they want to thug, you know? Yeah. And that is, of course, the worst thing. Because if you thug on one juggalo everybody the gathering of the good juggalos. Everyone's turning against you're you. You're in the wrong place. You know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah. yeah no, that's it, as, as, as crazy. I didn't know you guys had ODB. Or even if you're up there trying to act like you're too you're cool to be there. than them. Right, 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 right. right. And, and you, you know what I'm saying? The only ones that ever got away with clearly looking harder than them was fucking um, last year. <laughs> Who played last year? The, the main group. I'm, I'm, I can't remember. I'm being so dumb. Um, not Suicide Boys. The other... Uh, um, um, those dudes. I know who you're talking about. Um, City Morgue. Yeah. City Morgue, yeah. yeah. City Morgue. City Morgue goes up there, bro. They killed it. They killed it? Fucking slayed them. Wow. Like, I, that's they love that wicked shit. Fire. The city morgue is a, is a uh, version of, si- of wicked shit. Yeah. And Suicide Boys. Mm-hmm. Listen to them. They do that 3-6 mafia shit. Yeah. It's like very fucking 3 six. The Suicide Boys are very, very 3-6 mafia style. Man. I yeah. feel like DJ Paul's kind of a, adopted the juggalo, slum American oh, ju- d- fan DJ base Paul's, pretty heavily. Me and DJ Paul are, are actually fucking very close. No, he's a great guy. He's so fucking great, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We did an album together. He wouldn't stay at my house. I have my studios in my, in my front yard, right? He wouldn't stay at my house because he didn't like the woods I live in. He's like, fuck that. <laughs> I'm like, what? What do you think? A bear's going to jump through the window or something? That's crazy. But he's the shit, man. He's so dope. I love him, man.